Today I'm going to show you how to use the 10% method to help you work out a percentage of an amount. Uh, this is a really easy and quick method to use. So let's work through some examples. So example 1, so we're going to work out 10% of 420 pounds. So if you just read in the bubble, to work out 10% all you need to do is work, divide the number by 10. So all we have to do is work out 420 divided by 10. So since you've got a zero at the end you can just take this zero off which gives you £42. So let's do another example. So example 2, this time let's do 10% of £267. So again to get 10% we just need to divide the number by 10. So we do 267 divided by 10. So just hop the decimal point in a place and you get 26.7 which is the same as £26.70. So once you have 10% of a number, you can use the 10% to work out other percentages. So let's move on to example 3. So we're going to work out 30% of £520. So if you work out 10% first of all, so 10% of our amount 520 is 52, because we just divide that by 10. So this time we need 30%, so we need 3 of these 10%. So we can write 3 of these down and add them up. Alternatively, you could do 52 times 3. So if you add these to three numbers up, we get 2, 4, 6, 5, 10, 15, so we get £156. So let's move on to another example. So example 4, this time let's go with 20% of £73. So again, just start off with 10%. So 10% of 73 is £7.30. Again, just move your decimal point in because there isn't a zero to take off. So we want 20% this time, so we need two of these 10%. So if we add these up, this will give us 20%. 0 0 is 0, 3 is 6. 7 out 7 is 14. So our final answer is £14.60. Another thing with the 10% method is that you can also work out 5%. Uh, to get 5% you just half the 10%. So let me just write this down. So to get 5% half the 10% amount. So let's do one last example. So example 5, we're going to work out 35% of £3,600. So again all we need to do is start off by doing 10%. So 10% of 3600 is 360 Again, just take your zero off. So if we do three of these, that will give us 30%. And then you should be able to see now that we just need an extra 5% to get to 35. So we need to add a 5% on. So if you read that in the bubble, to get 5%, you half to 10%. So we just need to half the 10% amount. So half of 360 is 180. The final thing again is just to add all these numbers up. 
10, 20, 30, 35 percent and we've got 0, 8, 14, 20, 26, 3, 6, 9, 10, 11, 12 so we get a final answer of £1,260. So as you can see the 10% is a really quick and easy way of working out percentages. Um, it usually works fine for most non-calculator questions. Um, if you did have your calculator then you probably prefer to use a different method.